Hey guys, welcome to another video or welcome for the first time if you are new here. I am Miss Mini Life and I make tiny doll houses and dioramas. I know right now with everything going on in the world, it can be a little bit tough to find the inspiration to create anything. I really wanted to bring you guys a little bit of the outdoors. Some of you may be stuck in the snow right now and I'm super lucky and live somewhere where there's no snow. <laughs> so I went out searching for gardens around the city to get some inspiration for this Tiny Tuesday diorama that I was building. Unexpected gardens, which I found lots of. Um, it was really interesting that some buildings that I had just driven past my whole life or just never really looked at, I guess, had really beautiful gardens that someone had started. There was one food garden for displaced teens that I found in front of um, an arts building in Santa Monica. And it was, I'm assuming it's just always been there, but I never noticed it. Um, this world looks so different when you're just on foot and you're, you don't have a real like goal for why you're, you're going out. You're just exploring um, and you're really able to see things that you never would have noticed before. So I really liked that one. Another um, one that I didn't get a ton of footage of, but it was really beautiful. There's this guy who is unfortunately currently residing in a tent under a freeway. And in that situation that a lot of people might see as like a bleak, like worst case scenario or become really discouraged by, he had created this like potted, um, potted, um, I don't know what to call those, terrace gardens or what are they? Well, whatever he had created this potted garden in front and just on the sidewalk and I thought it was really beautiful so we took some pictures and um, we, we filmed it a little bit and just even seeing like the potted plants that have been abandoned because COVID-19 has shut down the buildings that they were attached to and since no one's going to work no one's watering the plants and I don't know, these are just weird things that I think about <laughs> when I find inspiration to create stuff and uh, I was really inspired by all these different things. So so today um, I've made this tiny urban garden and it's just one, um, it's one little planter box because on with Tiny Tuesdays I really want to do like little, really little projects. Um, not as huge or a large scale as the, the things that I do pretty much like twice monthly. This cute little planter box and my little plant that is not based on any real plant that I just created out of my mind. Um, and the sign says food bank garden, edible flowers, because it's sort of in memory of the food bank for displaced teens that we saw when we were out um, walking around the city. So hopefully you guys like this and if you want to see how I made it, there's going to be the build part right after I finish talking. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm going to show you guys how I did this. There's some gaps. Okay. So no matter what I do, it seems, even though my dad has given me his camera and I'm not filming everything on my iPhone anymore. Somehow I still managed to lose some footage. So I don't know how to fix that um, other than like, getting like an external hard drive and just dumping everything right after I film. So maybe I'll do that. I don't know guys. I, if anybody has any tips on how not to lose, randomly lose pieces of, the, of what you filmed and you can let me know, that would be great. I'm struggling. Okay. So, without further ado, here's the build for this.
All right, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, we're at 400 subscribers somehow. How the heck did this happen? <laughs> I literally like a video ago, I was like, oh, 250 subscribers, this is great. And now somehow I'm at 400. So I'm super excited about that, guys. I love you and I'll see you in the next video.